Talking about food and cancer in the same sentence used to be a taboo topic within the medical field. No doctor would ever dare to say that food and drinks had anything to do with cancer, but that is the past. More than 30 years ago. Nowadays, we all know that food has a direct impact on health. You're probably aware of the protective effects that certain cancer fighting foods and drinks can have over our system. What's even more impressive is how some widely consumed beverages in the entire world have also been shown to be powerful against cancer. So, in today's video, I'm going to reveal six of the top cancer fighting drinks available out there and why you should consume them. On a daily basis. Hey guys, Dr. Gus here, naturopath, acupuncturist, conventional doctor, and founder of DrLandivar.com. In this channel, as a conventional doctor, treat my patients through natural medicine before recurring to the use of pharmaceutical drugs. So, if you're new to my channel, consider subscribing and press that bell down below to get notifications and be the first one to watch new video. If you need a line of appointment quality supplements for your disease, visit drlandivar.com. And I encourage you to stay till the end of this video, where I'm going to share extra tips and video links related to this topic. If you ask any natural specialist what are some of the best ways to fight cancer, he'll probably tell you that one of them is done by juicing. You're probably aware of the protective effects that certain cancer fighting foods have on the entire body, or better yet, of an extract that can have on cancer. Believe it or not, well renowned organizations like the American Institute for Cancer Research have recommended certain drinks in our diets. Like coffee, for example, green tea, red wine, and vegetable or fruit juices are all among the best choices. So, in today's video, I'll reveal six of the top cancer fighting drinks available out there and why you should be consuming them on a daily basis. Number one, soursop or graviola juice. If you've ever wondered which fruit is the best one or the best option to fight cancer or prevent cancer, by that matter, Soursop and graviola is your choice. New research published in the Food and Function magazine recently reported that important bioactive components found in the graviola leaf and extracts have positive cancer fighting properties. Soursop contains enzymes that have free radical scavenging abilities. This means that they have enzymes that can help eliminate cancer cells. It's believed that the guanavana leaves can kill off cancer cells by blocking the production of ATP. Which is the energy source we have in cells. Now, the most interesting thing is that the graviola leaf extract can help block its activity, which helps reduce the cancer cell impact in our system and they fall apart. Apart from blocking the production of ATP in cancer cells and scavenging for free radicals, scientists in the Institute of Technology in Mexico have also discovered that a substance called acetogenine, which is in the guanabata fruit, has chemotherapeutic properties. If you don't find it as a fruit, you can actually use its extracts or leaves prepared as tea, anything, any way you can. Either way, believe me, it's very, very effective. Use a fruit, use its leaf, its bark, any way you can use it is better than none. If you need a good quality multi supplement for that has the power to keep your immune system healthy and strong, and at the same time working properly to make sure that cancer never appears, look for Ein Defense from Finland at drlandivar.com. Number two, celery juice. I really believe celery is exceptional. Listen to this every part in the celery plant is edible and it has medicinal properties. Most people choose only to eat its stalk, but leaves and seeds of the celery are edible and very beneficial. Now, what most people don't know is that celery indeed is one of the most powerful plants against cancer or for cancer prevention. Think about celery as a cleanser. It frees your liver and your body from toxins, from substances that accelerate that cancer creation, maybe at some point in your life, but at the same time provides every single nutrient or vitamin you need against it. Vitamin K, for example, which plays a role in coagulation, folate, needed for the human body to replicate you know, healthy DNA, potassium, which helps regulate blood pressure and heart contractility, manganese, calcium, riboflavin, magnesium. And the list just goes on and on. It's very powerful and very protective. Celery, if you can, every single day as a vegetable, as a juice. Celery juice is excellent as an anti cancer beverage. Use it any way you can. Number three, coffee. Yes, coffee is an anti cancer beverage. 
You see, coffee is a concentrated source of antioxidants called phytochemicals. Some of the most powerful against cancer include theophylline, theobromine, chorogenic acid, quinic acid, cafestol, and even cowil. Now, what do all these names mean? They're weird names, but they're very important because what they mean is that several studies have seen how coffee or coffee consumption has been linked to a reduced risk of liver cancer, colorectal, endometrial, and even oral cancers. Believe it or not, with respects to liver, coffee is one of the most powerful beverages you can take to prevent cirrhosis, which is basically a critical damage of your liver. Now, obviously, not everyone is built to consume coffee every day. Some find it, you know, it contains too much caffeine. Maybe it doesn't really keep you or help you sleep at night. It all depends. If you can, why not consume it? Maybe one to two cups a day is enough, and maybe that will help you prevent cancer at some point in your life. Number four, green tea. Cancer is caused by an uncontrolled growth of cells and are now becoming one of the world's leading causes of death, by the way. One important factor that contributes to the formation of cancer is oxidative stress, and green tea is one of those powerful sources for antioxidants that protect our cells and our bodies against this threat. In several human studies, green tea has demonstrated the powerful prevention you know, source it can be for specific cancers like breast, prostate, and even colorectal cancers. In breast cancer, for example, a meta-analysis, which is a summary of many studies, found that women who drank green tea had a 20, listen to this, 20 to 30% lower risk of developing breast cancer. With prostate cancer, one study found that men who drank green tea had a 48% lower risk of developing prostate cancer, which is a lot. And with colorectal cancer, an analysis of 29 studies showed that drinking green tea was up to a 42% less likelihood of developing cancer. Now, if you think about it, putting all these terms together or these numbers together, that's close to a 50% decrease in cancer prevention, which is a lot. It's extreme. It's a lot. Just by itself, green tea is spectacular and people don't consume it as much. So try to drink it every time you can. Number five, red wine. Red grapes and therefore red wine are filled with compounds called resveratrols. Several studies are now suggesting that these chemicals found in wine are contributing to the destruction of cancer cells and inhibition of cancer cell growth in people. According to one study published in the European Journal of Cancer Prevention, there is evidence, quote, there is evidence that wine consumption decreases the risk for cancer at several sites, including digestive tracts, lung cancer, colon cancer, and basal cells. Keep in mind that the effects of matured wine have a stronger effect than younger wines because, you know, older wine is better. But red wine seems to be especially beneficial at combating colony formation of cancer cells. Breast cancer, esophageal carcinoma cells, all sorts of cancers. In summary, very effective, very, very effective, and not just for cancer, but also for heart, circulation, and much more. So if you can, a cup of wine will help save the day. And how about the channel? Make sure to thumbs up and sharing with your friends and family. And if you have any questions, leave your comments down below. I'll be happy to assist you. If you need quality supplements for your disease or line of appointment, visit drlenovar.com and check out these other videos related to this topic. If you have other information that might prevent a serious health condition in the future. Thanks for watching, you guys, and I'll see you soon.